Camila Cuella. Is this your lawyer with you? No, this is my dad. Oh, it's no, your dad. dad? Yeah. Oh, I thought it was your lawyer. No. <laughs> no. 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 Why is he here? To pay for the summons? Um, uh, just for support. Yeah. Oh, for support. Emotional and financial support. Emotional? Yeah. <laughs> and financial. In other words, you're just being a daddy, right? Yeah. Being a father. That's what fathers do. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Particularly where their it's mothers a full-time are, job. Particularly where their mothers, are, their, ch their daughters are involved, right? Right. Yeah. How many children do you have? Uh, two. And yeah, what's the other one, a boy or a girl? Boy. Oh, so she gets yeah, all the yeah, attention. Younger than Camila. So she He's gets all the attention, right? No, he gets all the attention. Usually. Oh, he gets all the attention. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you're making up then. He's making up now, yeah, trying to give yeah. you, <laughs> trying to give you some attention. Yeah, I know a little bit about this. I have uh, five children, four boys and one girl. I have to split the attention, you know, so sometimes it's difficult. Yeah, it yeah. is. I'm not going to get into that because <laughs> <laughs> parents know what we go through. Okay, let's take a look at what you did wrong here, Camilla. Oh, okay. Have you been driving for three years? Yes, I think so. Yeah, Your Honor, she sure, probably about six, seven months uh, of having a good driving record. All right, Camilla, right, we checked out your driving period of time. You don't meet the three-year requirement to get the case dismissed okay. on a good driving record. So, sir, you have to put up with this now. See, so you have the one daughter, this is what happens. I know how this stuff works. She's, she's been driving well, so she's been unfortunately she's shy from the three years, yeah. What do you do? You go to school? Yes, I go to school at University of New Hampshire. Mm -hmm. What are you studying? Environmental engineering. Oh, what's your dream job? Um, I want to help, like, uh, under-resourced communities get clean water. What's the biggest issue with clean water? Is it, uh, what kind of pollution? Um, uh, there's a lot of air pollution that gets into the water. Um, it's mostly, like, pH levels are really bad, and then there's a lot of, like, microplastic in the water. And a lot of, like, countries that you'd think would, like, have a lot of water surrounding them don't get the clean water due to like lack of infrastructure, that should be fixed. So do you volunteer anywhere for, uh, for this? Um, not, not yet, because I do plan on volunteering when I'm at school more. At, there we have a club called Engineering Without Borders, so I'd love to be a part of that this year. But um, this past year I, was, I got diagnosed with MS, so I didn't really have a lot of time like on campus. I had to come back home a lot. But um, I do plan on doing a lot of that this year. Mr. Coelho, you should be very proud of your daughter. She made an excellent appearance here today. She did. And she sure did. That appearance, Thank you. That appearance reflects greatly on you as a parent. It's mostly her mom. <laughs> and I was going to get to that. And, and her mom as well. Right. So you've done an excellent job raising your daughter. We wish you well. Thank you. The matter is going to be dismissed. Thank you. And... Someday down the line, right? This is dismissed regardless of what you do, but I know you're going to do what I'm asking you to do. Somewhere down the line, right? Next year, 10 years, just volunteer 10 hours for any community for, with water treatment, anything, right? Dealing with your occupation to help people. Yes, I definitely will. All right, I'm sure you will, right? But anyway, you make an excellent appearance before the court. You've done your family proud. Thank you. And we wish you well. Thank you so much. Good luck to you. The matter is dismissed. Thank you, Your Honor. Mm -hmm.